Welcome to the Thimble.io Educator Platform. We're super excited to have you, and what we're going to be doing is giving you an overview on how to create a classroom, how to add a user to the classroom, and how to assign licenses to these users. From there, if you keep watching our video tutorials, you will get an overview of how to view the classroom dashboard and how to view reports. Let's get started. So as we're in here, I'm going to go into the Thimble.io district. You'll see that you have um, your high level overview. So we have four classrooms, four school users, 15 students, and then you can see a breakout of students per school. From here, I'm going to go into my schools. So you can go into schools underneath the manage menu on the left hand side or the manage schools button in the top, um, top right. So if you click manage schools, I'm gonna go into Thimble.io and what we're going to do is I see, wow, we already have 13 classrooms, which is amazing, but we're going to add one more. I'm gonna click into the classrooms and create a classroom. We'll do Thimble.io Summer 2023 Camp, and the grade here is five. From that, I'll save the details, and that's all I have to do. I'll scroll down, and you'll see that my Summer 2023 classroom is already created. I have zero students, but I am going to add students and teachers to this classroom. So in order to get started, I'm going to create my users. So I'll create a user. First, I'm gonna add a school educator and we'll do um, the Thimble.io demo again. And we're going to add myself. And I will be able to do um, either admin, edit, or view. So if you wanna to talk to your customer success manager about the role permissions or visit our knowledge base, we have all of those broken out for you. But I'm going to do admin and save my details. Great, now I'm prompted I can create a school student. So again, we're gonna click student, okay. And we'll create a student email, save details, amazing. So now we have our student and educator created. So I'm gonna go back into our school and our classroom and I'm going to assign my student and assign to class. You'll see all of the options for the students and I will save details. Then I'm gonna go back to the classroom and we'll assign the teacher. Assign to class, Jessica Allison. Great, now we're all good to go. However, we don't have our licenses yet. So I'm gonna go into licensing and make sure that I make our users live. So again, our amazing customer success team will be able to walk you through the district, school, and student licenses. But for this, for examples, I'm gonna show you the school license. So I'm going to do assign license and I'm going to, oh, I'm gonna actually check my user so I'm gonna just add myself and assign the license here. That will mean I'm automatically licensed. You'll see this change from unlicensed to active. And then I'm going to go back to licensing and go to student and check my Jessica Allison student and just go up and do assign license. And you'll see that now I'm active. So now I am ready to go in my summer camp 2023 classroom. And don't worry, we have all of this documented for you in how-to documentation. So you will never ever have to memorize these steps, but we, we hope to make it as easy as possible. Stay tuned to, take, to get an overview of the dashboard and the reports. Thank you.